Here we go with your basic assessment video. We're going to start out with the basic swing post test. As you pivot in the backstroke, we notice more weight goes to the right side than the left side. Your head even swivels a little bit to the right. You do have a little counter swivel action with your hips, which means that you're going to be somewhere between rear anchor and center anchor, just a little bit right of center. Now we're going to look at your basic swing anchor test and see if they confirm what we saw in the basic post test. As you start the full front anchor test, we're going to notice your head move considerably off the ball during the backswing. You move back into impact and then in your fall through you go ahead and fall backwards showing us that your, your balance point somewhere rear of that front anchor alignment. You're a lot more balanced in the center anchor test, however you do move off the ball a little bit to the right and you have some of that counter swivel action we saw in the basic post test showing us that you're somewhere you know, near center but rear of center. As you do the rear anchor test we're going to notice that you actually fall forward in this test showing us that you're definitely somewhere forward of the full rear anchor alignment. Once again it looks like you're somewhere between center and rear anchor. As we move into the basic swing path test we're going to notice from the side on view that you definitely make a side on action. It looks like your right elbow moves to your side and your forearms are definitely facing side to side instead of up or down. In the down the line view we see the same thing. Your elbow moves to your side and you have a side on alignment. To recap, your swing anchor is going to be between rear anchor and center anchor, and we'll do a refinement test to find out exactly where that is, and your swing path is side on. In the next video, we're going to do an assessment of your swing.